This is a rule that the administration promulgated that says no one can get asylum if they've transited through a third country. We went to court, got an injunction, a nationwide injunction blocking the rule. The Supreme Court stayed that injunction and allowed the rule to go into place while the merits of the case proceeded. We are now up on appeal in the Federal Court of Appeals for the Ninth Circuit, arguing the merits of the case, and that's what was heard today. In this case, the district court issued an extraordinary nationwide injunction halting a critical executive branch rule designed to prioritize urgent asylum claims, deter meritless ones, combat human smuggling, protect vulnerable migrants, and find a lasting diplomatic solution to the shared international problems presented by unconstrained mass migration. Look, if somebody has gotten um, such a secure situation in a third country that they're firmly resettled, then they categorically don't need to access our asylum system. I would never predict how the court is going to rule, but I, I would say the court was extremely well prepared and pushed back on the government's claim that the record in this case shows that there's a fair and safe asylum process in Mexico and Guatemala. Our, our claim is that people do not apply in those countries because it's not safe for them to do it and there's no fair asylum process. The government's own record, as the judges pointed out, shows that it's not safe in Mexico.